The 44, I mean, that's such a well-known, legendary cartridge. It's been around forever. Lever action rifles to handguns, depending on what you want to uh, set it up and shoot it with. The 44, I mean, it is a, a proven cartridge that has stood the test of time. Now, there's a lot of different bullets to choose from out there that I think people have to spend time with, a lot of different loads. The 44 is a very popular hand load. A lot of people reload them, but there's a wide range of factory loads out there. And I think if you match it up for the size the game, the, the weight, the bullet grains, what you're looking for, you're going to be impressed with the 44 and you shoot it out of this Performance Center Stealth Hunter, you're going to love the results. So I'm shooting my 44 Magnum here from the Smith & Wesson Performance Center. This is one of my favorite hunting handguns right here. I've got a Trigicon SRO uh, sight on here. It's really easy to acquire the target. And right now I'm practicing off these Birchwood and Casey uh, bags to just give me a good brace. I'm 51 yards away from the target right now. I'm wanting to really get my zero good and established because I'm going to hunt with the 44 several times this year. We're going to talk about the 44 as a hunting cartridge and right now I'm, I'm literally I've got a great little group right there about three inches low. I mean I've got two bullets down there look like they're almost touching from from this far away and one just slightly above it and uh, so I'm going to raise my sight, my point of impact about uh, literally three inches and uh, we'll shoot some more and then get, get it dialed in. Well, it's fun shooting that 44. I mean, that's the handgun caliber I shot my very first whitetail deer with. And I was pretty nervous in that entire encounter. And, and I still remember it vividly, the way that deer was darting in and out. It was rutting, fighting with another deer. And when I, I finally, I was sitting on the ground, I was all, you know, catty corner and I got him and I, I pulled my shot a little bit. And through that whole process, I just, I've learned I've got to practice and really work on my trigger pull with a handgun. I just I, we're really with anything you need to do that and here we're, we're dialing this in with the with the uh, SRO site from Trigicon shooting 200 uh, grain XTP 44 mag from Hornady right now and, and trying to get consistency and my, my early shots were low I started you know adjusting the site this is a very easy site to adjust you've got just little clicks here right there it tells you what you're doing and then i've got my dot fairly small and i'm shooting just a little over 50 yards off of these sandbags here to simulate you know my hunting situation and this caliber is really a dynamic caliber through this handgun uh, to be able to perform for what we're going to be doing for a whitetail hunt